want two refills, please? Definitely. No, nah, just taking it easy. Oh, I wish I could. Yeah, new baby's gonna take some looking after. Yeah, too true. You will try it sometime. Yeah, maybe. Listen, uh, what are you and Cindy doing on Thursday? Probably ignoring each other. What? Oh, nothing. Why? Only it's uh, Sharon's birthday on Thursday. I was thinking about getting a crowd together in the Vic, turning into a bit of a party. All right. Um, well, look, I can't vouch for Cindy or anything, but um, I'll be there. I could do it with a laugh. No offence, but I just want you to do the catering lay on a bit of a spread. Cheers. Well, if you don't want the work, that's fine, but... No, it's all right. I'll do it. I'll give you a quote later. Am I invited? Yeah, sure. It kicks off about eight. First drinks on the house. Should probably only stop for one, then. No, anyone wants a dog? Dog? Yeah, your kids would love one. Would they? Yeah, I had one when I was a youngster. Listen, there you go. That's a uh, quote for Sharon's day tonight, huh? A uh, cup of tea, please, and a bowl of water for the dog. Sorry, I can't serve you in here. What? You can't bring a dog in here. But that's my dog. It doesn't matter. You can't bring a dog in here. <laughs> wonder why we never saw Sharon in here. <laughs> See this quote? Be careful what you say in the future. Yeah, look, on, I was only joking. You see me laughing. And as for you, don't bother coming tonight. My dog's barred. You're barred. Got it? Can't anybody take a joke these days? How about going to pool? Yeah, right, why not? Please don't try to get trouble. Us? You're out. Got a free breakfast off that lovely Ian Bill. You noticed anyone following you? No. Sure. Pretty sure why. Don't matter. See, now there's someone that could do with a slap when you're gonna do, aren't you? I, I don't want any trouble. Calm down, Ian. Just don't do any ninja moves on me. We're closed. Where is she? <laughs> Where? Is she? I don't know what you're talking about. Ian, where's Chrissy? I don't know. She just left. I don't know where she's gone. That's the truth. Let's get through the airport. Yeah, there's a flight at eight. Which leaves just the rest of the day to sort out our last little problem. Yesterday was a problem. Today, it's all pleasure. <laughs> Just read that. I find it's all legal and above board. Had it checked out by my brief this morning. So how long has this been on the cards? No, it doesn't matter now. When exactly did Chrissy sign it? All that matters is she has. It's low life bothering you. The riffraff you're getting here these days. Hey, hold on, get your hands off of me. Just sling him out for you. Hey, you can't throw me out. Tell him, Sharon. I'm the new landlord. All that kit fat battered your brains. Hey, Sharon, tell him! Sharon, tell him I've got a contract! You won't get away with this, Mitchell. Do you hear me? You won't get away with this. Here you. Where the bloody hell do you think you're going? Was that Bill? Yeah. Uh, sorry, Richard. I'll have to call you back. I might have known you'd sink to this. That's you all over, isn't it? First you try slap happy, then you do meek and humble, and when that doesn't work, you take what you want. Listen, you're going to have to explain yourself, otherwise you're going to find yourself bouncing off the top of the fruit and veg stall. I'm talking about Ben, Phil, and you doing what you do best. Good at child snatching, aren't you? What is this? Private panto? Oh, and here we are, as if you two don't know. Ben! It's me, I've come to take you home, mate. It's all right, don't be frightened of this lot. The last time I saw him here was at your house. Now, where is he? Out of my way, Grant. I'm not in the mood. Funny, that. Neither am I. Now, Phil will bring Ben back when he's ready. If he's not back in an hour, I'm coming to get him. You okay? What are you doing about there? Uh, we were just talking about Ben. Why don't you tell him the truth, Jane? What? I was just about to have my wicked way with it. Oh, yeah, right. What can I get you? Nothing. What, so you're just going to take up valuable space, are you? He had a cup of tea. Oh, a cup of tea? Oh, we can book that luxury cruise after all, if you don't mind. We've got paying customers. What's got into you? Well, thanks to you, all I've had in my face all morning is Mitchell's. Look, 
It was important that Phil spoke to his son. Grant, come in for a cup of tea. It's hardly a conspiracy. Mm, take your near side as usual. You think you're happy, do you? Eh? You think you give Jane what she wants? Well, let me tell you something about your precious Jane, shall I? You're right about her being in bed with the Mitchells. Well, at least one of us, anyway. Because she was in bed with Grant. And she couldn't get enough of him. Get away from my wife! Mum said you wanted money. I could only get out 50. Oh, I got him off, so I'm going to head back. Do you know what? I won't give you a penny, even if you beg me. Ian, just hear him out. I'm not interested in anything he's got to say. He gave Phil the money to get me away from Gavin. I owe him, Ian. We should help. And I know about you and Jane all those years ago. Ian! And you know what? She chose me. Look, I'll get you the rest of your money. Keep it. You're supposed to be here to help Ben. I mean, have you seen the state of your brother? I mean, he needs your help. Your family needs your help. Why don't you, for once in your pathetic little life, do something good? Here you go. Is that better? Yes, love. No, no, what are you like? doing? No, no, no more. Don't lie to me. Phil Grant, told me. Get I went in on a couple of weeks, that's all. It's true, we didn't know. I uh, don't believe you. Look, you shouldn't right to come in here and assault me in my own home. Why'd you do it? Why'd you keep it from me all these years? She didn't want you involved in his life. Oh, because I'm that much of a monster, am I? Yeah, I mean, you just barged in here and assaulted me, and by all accounts, you made a right mess of bringing Courtney up. Grant! You know, I've just seen Mark out in the square. Do you know what he was doing? He was just about to kiss Courtney. What? Yeah, his sister. Only he doesn't know that she's his half-sister, does he? Because he's been kept in the dark just like me. Look, he's going back to America tonight. You'll probably never see her again. You can't tell him. Oh, I can tell him. Believe me, I can tell him. Why? What is the point? To make him feel like his whole life's been a lie? What can you give him, Grant? Just walk away. Please. You're right. You're both right. Everything I touch, I destroy. Um, Sharon, uh, you and Ian should set off. You saw us, Dad. Ben needs you. Go on, the pair of you and, um, Grant, could, could you stay? There's a few things I want to say to you. I'm not leaving you on your own with him. Ian, I'll be fine. Let's go. 